Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com daily analysis for gold for Thursday, July the 30th. Well, an interesting uh, day is trading today and we can see that this, uh, uh, in bar chart terms, the uh, bar has a lower high but a higher low and that's what we call an inside day in bar chart terms, it's a day of indecision and it raises concerns about the uh, uh, the validity of the uh, first time frame downtrend that the market's in. The market is in a downtrend, we have a series of lower highs and lower lows and now we have uh, a day where that series of lower highs and lower lows couldn't continue. So we can't call that as an uptrend yet because for an uptrend we need a high high and a high low but we don't have a continuance of the lower high and uh, lower lows uh, which means that um, there's a, um, a lot of indecisiveness in the market. It means that the bears couldn't push the market down below the low and it means that potentially they've lost some of the power that they had now just looking at the candle itself, it's a green bodied candle and um, it's quite uh, consistent with some of these, the sizes of these previous candles but quite a bit smaller than the uh, last two candles which uh, once again raises um, doubts about the continuance of the first time frame downtrend and it's also a green candle which mean, means that the bulls have made um, net progress on the day, the bulls are in the ascendancy. Unfortunately for the bulls though, uh, they weren't strong enough to close the market up above the midpoint level so it means that um, even though the bulls have tried to uh, trade the market up, the sellers came in and closed the market around that midpoint level. And it means that the uh, neither side has control of the market. So there's a big battle going on. But remember, we are in a first time frame downtrend. So uh, if we see that the um, bears have lost control, and they did have control previously, they've lost control, and that raises doubt about the uh, the um, strength of this first time frame downtrend. It, it uh, suggests that there may be a um, change of trend to the upside. Now, in Ichimoku, sorry, in uh, candlestick charting terms, this is also what we call a harami pattern. It's a potential bullish reversal pattern. We have a downtrend, and we have um, the body of the current candle is uh, completely within the body of the previous candle, and that's a, a potential harami pattern. We need confirmation of that pattern, and confirmation will be the high of the current candle being taken out. So the high becomes very important for this market. Now just looking at the uh, other indicators, uh, our Ichimoku cloud has attracted the price action and quite often we've said that when the uh, bottom or top of the cloud goes flat it tends to be an attractor of price action. We also need to watch that we can have false breakouts from this so that the trend is still down so there still is potential for the market to continue the downtrend. So we need to watch for uh, a false breakout to the downside. Uh, if this market is going to continue to the downside uh, and especially down to this support area around nine, uh, around the 900 level, it's around 905, then we'd want to see a, a bearish close out down below the, uh, below the uh, bottom of the Kumo. Now if the market does appreciate, we have a close by resistance with the top of the cloud and that's roughly in the, uh, around the 940 or so, level 945 to 940. So there is potential resistance up around that level. Now looking at the other indicators as well, the market is trading between the um, Tenkan Sen and the Kijin Sen, which means um, indecisive. We're getting a lot of mixed signals here. We're trading within the Kumo, which means that the market is uh, neutral. It's neither bullish, uh, neither giving a bullish nor a bearish indication. So a lot of mixed signals in this market. And the Tenkan Sen and Kijin Sen are flat, which means uh, potential congestion for this market. So... Uh, not a traders, uh, good traders market. What we want to see is uh, some solid bullishness or bearishness coming into this market with a breakout above or below the cloud in either direction. Mm -hmm.